Prince William's special gifts from the Queen and Prince Philip reveal. The organization aligned with the Duke of Cambridge's conservation and environmental work. The Duke of Cambridge is incredibly close to the Queen and the Duke of Edinburgh, and on Monday, it was announced that his grandparents have passed down two of the patronages to the grandson. Prince William 38 has followed the Queen whose steps become the figurehead of Fauna and Flora International FFI and takes over from Prince Philip as patron of the British Trust for Ornithology BTO. The founding patroness for the Duke, who recently launched the Earthshot Rise to the find solutions to repair the planet over the next 10 years. FFI focuses on British biodiversity, which underpins healthy ecosystems and is critical for the life support systems that humans and all other species rely on. It protects threatened species and ecosystems worldwide, choosing solutions that are sustainable, based on sound science, and that enhance human well being. Operating more than 40 countries worldwide, FFI is also a founding member of Wins Williams. Organization, United for Wildlife, and was recently announced as Global Alliance Partner of the Earth Short Prize. The Queen has been patron of FFI for almost seven decades. Meanwhile, the British Trust for Ornithology aims to empower communities to protect local bird species and their natural habitats in order to ensure that they are preserved a generation's income. And was also working to promote the benefits of a natural world of one how health and well being. The Duke of Edinburgh held the role of patron for over 30 years. The Duke of Cambridge was publicly reunited with the Queen as the visitor of the Defence Science and Technology Laboratory, DSTR, near Salisbury on Thursday. It marked the first time the 94 year old monarch has carried out an engagement outside the royal residence in seven months amid the coronavirus pandemic. Prince Philip, who turned 99, has remained living in the good farm for the St. Bringham Estate after the Queen returned to Windsor Castle earlier this month. The Duke retired from public duties in August 2017.